how to use a VPN and what would you use one for with Windows 10. As you can see here, this is actually my IP address and it's telling you that I'm in Spain, it's giving you my location and pretty much I want to have a look at some of the BBC news sites and stuff that may actually be free in the UK but overseas can be blocked. Um, so what we have here is a free VPN login, um, VPN type, authorization, server, username, password. So what we need to do is get Windows 10 to recognize it. So the first thing we need to do is just go to the settings and we want to look for the network. So I said network and internet and you will see VPN over here. This one is actually, you just click add, um, but this one's already set up. So we'll click on this one. We'll go advanced options and we'll just edit it. This is what you will see. As you can see, my username, uh, connection name, VPN. That's what I called it. Um, you can put anything there. That's just so you know what it is. Server name and address you take from the site. There's a server. VPN type is automatic. Username and password is your login. Because you can have different types. You can have certificates and various types depending on which VPN setup you've got. Username, VPN for UK. VPN password is 1978. When I press save, and then go up here and click the arrow, connect, and you'll see it's going away, it's verifying my connection. I'm now connected, or just about. I'll give it another few seconds. There we go, we're connected. So as you can see, this is my IP, it says I'm in Spain. If I refresh the page, I'm gonna have to close this and reopen it. I'm now in London, England. It's as simple as that. Very quick, very easy. And if you find that it doesn't connect here, go back to advanced options, edit, and change the password. Because what I found with this one, because it's a free service, the password changes regularly. But even though I put it in manually here, when it will put a pop up now and again because it didn't recognize the password, it won't recognize it. I have to click edit and put it back in there and then it's fine and that's pretty much it thanks for watching